At first at 11, Greenville's Uptown District is now being called the Downtown District. Good evening, everyone. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Ken Watlington. Angie Casada has the evening off. The decision to rebrand comes from the Downtown Greenville Partnership Organization. Now your site's Caitlin Richards joins us now after speaking with that organization today. So Caitlin, why is the name Uptown being changed back to Downtown? Ken, I'm told the reason is because Downtown Greenville Partnership Organization's board members all have various investment roles and interests in the downtown community, making sure it continues to grow. But this isn't the first time Uptown is being named Downtown. The name Uptown served its purpose when it first was adopted back in you know 1994 and then officially in 2008 um, to kind of help bring back businesses, bring back uh, the people, start bringing it back. Um, but you know that's the Uptown name never quite stuck. Um, so that's kind of where the decision came to go back to the downtown. Uptown signs are already switching to downtown. Either we will pay for the the switching of the of the signage or reimbursing for city efforts into changing it. For mapping and information purposes, Parker says Google will hopefully show the downtown name change within the next couple of days. But some things won't change, such as the name of Uptown Brewing Company. We definitely did think about rebranding because they did bring it to our attention that they were going to rebrand it to downtown. But I believe, as far as I know, uh, that we will stick with Uptown Brewing. Um, I know we will we'll be in downtown, but it's kind of catchy, you know, has a good ring to it. So I think we're just going to stick with it. President and CEO of Greenville Pitt County Chamber of Commerce, Trent McGee, said in a statement in part, quote, Choosing to refer to Greenville's center city district as downtown Greenville is meant to reflect the efforts being made to champion the economic health, growth, and vitality of the district. It's not just college bars anymore. It's an actual, you know, it's an, <laughs> there's an actual downtown with things for everybody from 18 to 100 to enjoy. Parker adds there are over 35 restaurants and over 25 shops in the downtown district and more positive changes are expected in the next couple of weeks. In studio, Caitlin Richards, 9 on your side. All right, Caitlin, thank you.